Hey guys, what's up Aries? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it how you need to. Also remember, it's a general reading, so just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe for the note. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. Looks like somebody is kind of pulled back from working towards something, or just kind of like an unattentive energy. Alright, immediate future for Aries, please. Yeah. I'll take the two that then flip. That was too many. You got the Lovers, Gemini Energy, the Four of Cups, Cancer Energy, and the Knight of Swords. So, I mean, it kind of feels like somebody, like I said, hasn't been moving towards something, hasn't been taking initiative, may have got fed up with the situation, or it's just, it could just be not even taking action. But we're ending with the Knight of Swords, so it looks like some type of communication that's, that's coming through. Alright, so for the situation, like I said, you got the lovers, which is Gemini energy and the two of wands. So it feels like something's about to actually um, move forward here. Somebody could have had a choice, a decision in general. You might have had multiple options, but um, it feels like there's been some type of like distance or lacking. For some, there could have been financial issues. But also, um, somebody could have just ghosted, kind of like really went quiet, went silent. Okay, show me the um, Four of Cups for the obstacle. So it looks like somebody has a choice here, like I said. One way or another is just trying to move forward towards something. But without lovers, that's Gemini energy again. But um, with the with the lovers, there can be a third energy that kind of comes in between of things. Show me this uh, Four of Cups, please, for the obstacle. So the Four of Cups is Cancer Energy, but like I it's it's not budging towards something. It's like not making a choice, a decision. It looks like you may have got fed up with something here. You may have walked away from it. it could have kind of pissed you off a little bit. Things weren't equal give and take. <clears throat> There's still a lot of love down here, but when it comes to moving forward or making this decision, it's like things kind of come to a crossroads where there is a choice over here. It's almost like you, you may have cold shouldered something. Because that decision hasn't been made. Like you may have got kind of fed up with something and not going towards it anymore. Show me this Knight of Swords for the outcome for Aries, please. So you could be dealing with a younger air sign. Doesn't have to be. Looks like somebody's trying to talk. This person could be at a distance. They're stuck. They're worried. Because you're not moving towards something anymore. You have other options. So we have we started with the two of wands. So it's like things tried to progress, but somebody could have just ghosted or have been having money issues. However, things have kind of came to a standstill. Sometimes, depending on what this is, how this is going to resonate for you with the four of cups, um, you could have got set up with a situation, but also it's like something's floating right here and kind of not going towards it anymore. So. For the outcome, the Knight of Swords is about communication and messages and things like that. But somebody is worrying their ass off right now. Hurt. Heartbroken. Kind of stuck there. Alright, Aries. I hope this helps. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. You guys take care and I will see you next time. Bye.